Here's you guys a real quick update. Uh, that's a 22 shelf, of course. It's bare all the way across. We still get the three box limit here. Um, there's not much up there. A little overpriced 556, five, and then there is a couple boxes of two, 223 two, and uh, 76239. Some hunting rounds are down there. A little high price 223. We do have some 25 automatic, which is somewhat harder to find. And this morning, these came in. This is the most 9mm that I've saw in the store. And she said she has about 100 more boxes of the 50 round uh, down below. That's not a bad price for Jacket at Hollow Point. There's the 9. We got uh, these just came in today. And there's that many 38 special 38 special so I feel like that's a pretty good price for it being Winchester Winchester usually seems to be a little overpriced there's your 40 shelf of course but lately the nines have been cleared out so I'm surprised to see more nine millimeter uh, well maybe not more but close to as much nine millimeter as 40 it's 44 mags Heard a guy saying he was looking for this morning. Uh, 100 round 45, 50 round 45, guard dog, and then shotgun shit uh, down there. This I will show you as well. Uh, I wonder if your if your guys Walmart's carry the uh, Blackhawk quad rail for 130 and left it out like this, not locked up. I'm shocked. Um, it's a hell of a price. Hell of a price. So, and that was heart round 12 gauge rollback, rollback, rollback. Of course, they're all gone. Uh, but that would have been a sweet score. Sweet score. Uh, think about picking one of these guys up. If any of you have used one, let me know uh, before I buy it. But when I compare the price of this and just a couple more shooting bags, I'm going for six bucks. I can get a vice and a rest. So, compared to the bags. But anyway. That's just a real quick update of my Walmart. That's the bad boy. 